Hey guys, what's going on? It's KFMZ here, back with another YouTube video. Today we are playing Clash Royale again with our level 1 account. Today's goal is to get into Arena 5 because we did just unlock this and this. So we should be able to go on some pretty good, uh, make some pretty good decks with both of those. So let's throw in the minions for the bomber because minions and hog go well together. And let's just hop into the first battle. Alright, first battle up against Rei Leonidas. 1269, level 6. If he's level 6, that means he must not be too good. That's how I think of it. So let's go Musketeer in the back. Alright, let's go Skeleton Army. Fireball. And now that was a good elixir trade. Now we can get our Hog Rider up with our Musketeer. And he just used all of his elixir prop, it looks like. So, that's going to do a lot of damage to the tower. He's going to put down a mini P.E.K.K.A. Let's go minions. And now let's go. Let's see, will that do any damage? Alright. Now... Hopefully those minions can get at least one shot off. He's going to go with his Inferno Tower for some reason. That is strange. Okay. Let's just throw our Goblin Barrel down on that right-hand tower. Wait, nope. He's going Hog. We'll go Inferno Tower. Now let's throw our Goblin Barrel. And let's hope that he has nothing to defend that with. Yep, he has no Elixir or he's just not defending it. He's going to throw a Minion Horde late. So let's Fireball it. And now we already have that right hand tower down to 550. That seems like a goblin barrel should do it. He's going to arrow nothing because the inferno tower is already going to die. So now we can go that and that. And now he has a Tesla as well as an inferno tower, a two defense deck, which is not the greatest in my opinion. So now that should do some pretty good damage on that left hand tower. He's going to go late baby dragon again. Now let us Goblin Barrel, the left hand tower if the Musketeer doesn't die. Let's throw it now. Now he has no elixir most likely. Let's go Skeleton Army. And now he has to make a decision on which one he wants to defend. Never mind, he didn't throw arrows on either one of them. But now that Skeleton Army gets arrowed, yep. And now we have that. Now let's go Hog Rider 08. Let's hope that Fireball lands quick enough. No, it doesn't appear that we're going to get any hits off. Let's go Inferno Tower. Now, let's go Goblin Bear on that right-hand tower. He's going to go Hog Rider. Let's go Skeleton Army. I'm playing extra cautionish. Now, that's going to take out the right-hand tower. Musketeer to take out the left. And now, one, two, three, four. Now, let's go Hog Rider. Minions. And Goblin Barrel. Now, let's go Fireball on these Minion Horde. And that is the game, guys. First battle, we do win against level 6. Goblin Barrel Hog Rider is looking good. Uh, silver Chest, unfortunately. Haven't been getting any good chests. Like, uh, I haven't gotten a Super Magical or a Legendary yet. On this account or my good account. But second battle is up against... Black Sun. Okay. We're going to start with our Musketeer in the back. Right. Right there. Now let's get our push ready. Yep, and now let's go. This. 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 Now that's a good looking push right there. He doesn't have anything to fend. No, he is going to put down a Valkyrie. That and his arrows will take out the rest of the push. Uh, Musketeer does do a little damage to the Valkyrie, but let's go there. Now, he is winning right now, but I'm not sure who has the elixir advantage. Okay, let's get our Inferno Tower ready for any sudden push. Yep, let's go Inferno Tower this time. Because Musketeer did not do the job last time. The Inferno Tower will barely do the job. Now, oh, I was tempted to throw a Goblin Barrel right there, but we are going to save our Elixir. Let's go 
Goblin Barrel, Hog. Now the Goblin Barrel is going to land too early. And he has a Minion Horde, which was a good defense. Not so sure about the arrows. They were a bit late. And now he's going to go with all of this. Let's go Skeleton Army. Yep. Barely gets it off, but we did get enough. Now, we do have more crown tower, or tower damage, but I do think that he has the elixir advantage on us right now. Let's see. The Valkyrie's not going to do any damage to the tower. Minions should make it in. Nope. They, he places down his minion horde to defend the minions. Now, the musketeer should be a good defense to the minion horde. He's going to arrow. And now, let's go right hand tower goblin barrel. Uh, Hog. Hopefully Hog gets targeted. It does. Now let's go Inferno Tower. And is that going to do any damage to our tower? No, it will not. Let's go Minions. Now he's going to do this. Let's go our own Valkyrie. He's going to arrow basically nothing. Let's Goblin Barrel this left tower. Now let's Hog the right tower. Because he just put down his Minion Horde. Now it's Fireball the Minion Horde. Oh, and now he has all of this going down. Let's go Minions. Now let's go Valkyrie to, in the way back to hopefully keep him from taking out the tower. Is the tower going to go down? No, it will not. Let's go Goblin Bear on that left tower. Now let's hope that ours takes it out, and that will do it. That was close at the end. But we were managed to pull off another victory, and we do get a golden chest. Unfortunately, I'm not able to open it currently. Let's hop into another battle. We're up against Pat Pat 1990. <coughs> All right, he is another level six. Let's see if we can get a good first push. Let's go Hog Minions. Get our fireball ready. Nope, he puts down that. And a goblin barrel. Now let's go this and this. Now that should take out all the skeleton army. It does. And now we are off to a decent start. Let's see if we can get our goblin barrel down. No, we're not going to throw our goblin barrel. Hmm. I'm hoping soon that we do get a legendary troop. A legendary chest I'm thinking about buying. I'm not sure. But, yep. <coughs> Let's go Musketeer in the back. Now let's go Goblin Barrel Hog. He has been to Arena 5. Wow. Okay. Um, let's go... Um, Hog Rider. And now that's all we really should need to do. He places Inferno Tower down. Not the best spot for it. Musketeer gets targeted, so Goblin Barrel can go to work, which is very nice. Now we do uh, do a lot of damage to that right-hand tower. He's going to place his Skeleton Army down, so that's good for my Valkyrie. That should take it all out. And now let's go Musketeer right behind the Valkyrie. And there we go. That might be his right tower down. Maybe. One, three more hits. One, two, nope. But let's... Mm, no, let's just save our elixir. Get ready for an inferno tower. All right, let's just place it down. Okay, he's going to go that. Mm, it's not going to go to the inferno tower, so I'm going to have to do that. It was fine, though, because he's also going to put down his prince... And the prince should go down, so should that right hand tower. He's going to throw his um, inferno tower down in the back corner. So that means we can get a good push going now on this. Let's go skeleton army to defend the goblin barrel. And now the Valkyrie should take out all of that. Now let's go musketeer to defend the wizard. He's going to go with his giant skeleton. Let's go with... Inferno Tower. Now let's throw down our Goblin Barrel. Throw down our Hog Rider. Now he's going aggressive. Let's go Skeleton Army. That could be his right, town, right tower gone 
it will not be, but he's not going to be able to take out a hard tower either. That is another win with this new hog goblin barrel deck. And we are now at 1361. We could get into Arena 5 and win two more battles. So let's see if we can do it. We are facing another level 6. The amount of level 6 is, oh, he's been Arena 5 also. Let's go Valkyrie, Hog Rider. Now, I did not get the hog in front of the Valkyrie, or behind the Valkyrie, I mean, unfortunately. Which is going to cause the damage. No, drone, get out of here. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, no, that might be my tower gone because of that misclick. Uh, minion horde, minions, minion horde. Okay, now that could be GG because of that. No, it's not going to be yet, luckily. But that was very close. Now we do have to play kind of defenses. He's going to go with that. Not the smartest of moves, I don't think. Now let's get ready for a good push down the right-hand tower. Or the left, no, let's go. Valkyrie, Musketeer. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Now let's go. Hog Rider. The Valkyrie should take out the entire skeleton army as well. Unfortunately, it does not somehow. He's going to go with his prince. Let's go, skeleton army. Now let's go print or uh, Goblin Bear. How does he have a level three prince? I'd like to know, but that should do a lot of damage and take out the tower. So now we are tied up. Our crown tower still does have a lot of damage done to it, though. There goes a wizard to defend. That gets taken out immediately. Now he's gonna go for the three crown still. So let's just go Inferno Tower. Now let's go Valkyrie. That should take it all out. Now let's go Musketeer. Now let's go... Oh, he's going to go with his Prince. Let's do that. Now let's go Hog. Goblin Barrel. That could be a three crown, guys. No, it will not be because of that baby dragon, however. He's going to go with his Skeleton Army. Let's go Valkyrie, then, to take it all out. Now... Here it comes. I'm going to go Musketeer in the back corner. Now let's do that. Alright, that's not going to take out our Crown Tower again. Let's go Inferno Tower. Now that should take it out the Hog and the Baby Dragon. And the secondary Baby Dragon. Actually, no, it will not. So let's Fireball all of this. Let's go with our own Skeleton Army. Now let's get ready to push down this right-hand lane. Never mind, he's going to have to do that, so I'll defend it with my Valkyrie. Now let's go Goblin Barrel, Hog, my uh, minions, and now let's go Skeleton Army. That will do a lot of damage. Oh, now a Snapchat. What is this garbage? Okay, let's just ignore it. We remember what last time, what happened last time. Let's go Inferno Tower, and now... Let's go this. Okay. He What's he going to put down to defend? He's going to put down nothing. So let's go Hog Rider. Now Fireball right there. That could be the game. The comeback of dreams to get the three crown. We are slightly off of Arena 5, however. Wow. Yeah, let's just do one more battle, as we are still undefeated. He is level 4, so it is a little more reasonable, but I do think that means he's going to be better, because he's lower leveled in higher arena. So let's go Musketeer in the back. Maybe we can go on one big push at the very beginning. I'm going to ignore those archers, but not the Spear Goblins as well, such as Valkyrie, all of that. Now let's go... Skeleton Army, as he's going to keep going aggressive. Let's go Minions, because he just arrowed. Unfortunately, that is still a two-shot with the Minions. So let's go 
hog rider in front of the minions. Now, the archers are going to do some damage, but that should get some pretty good damage on the right hand tower. Let's go musketeer as a defense troop for all of this. Now, we're going to have to defend this right hand tower pretty well. He's going to go with his uh, goblin hut in the back corner. All right, we're going to start attacking down the left-hand lane so that he is forced to kind of push down the right. Nope, he's going to still go down that tower. So once the Valkyrie hits the bridge, I'm going to release that. And now that should tank for the goblin barrel. And that's going to be the left-hand tower if he puts nothing down to defend. He does, so that will not be the tower. But it will still do tons of damage. Now let's go... Minions up at the top so it gets the maximum amount of damage done to the uh, mini P.E.K.K.A. He is, however, going to put down archers, so I'm going to have to fireball all that. And that right-hand tower is pretty low, so I think I can ignore that. We're going to have to go Valkyrie for the skeleton army. Now, I'm getting ready. <clears throat> <coughs> Let's start up a big push going down the left-hand side. Okay. Let's go Musketeer. Okay. Now, let's go Goblin Barrel. Hog Rider. Minions. That should get targeted. It does. Now we can go Skeleton Army. Now we can go Valkyrie. And now let's throw another Goblin Barrel down. We are going a little too aggressive, I think. So let's start slowing it down. Playing a little defensive. So let's go... Inferno Tower. Okay, now let's go. Uh, Hog Rider. Skeleton Army. And. Uh, Valkyrie for all of this. That should all get one shotted. And now, that might actually take out the tower, however, still because of how much was down. And now we are going to go into overtime. There's still a lot down there, but I do not think it will take out the tower. So, yep, let's start going down here. Let's go Goblin Barrel, Skeleton Army. And that should take it all out. Now, let's see. Let's go Valkyrie and Fireball, Hog. And now, hopefully, get target. it gets targeted. It does get targeted. So now let's go uh, Goblin Barrel. Oh, wow. He has two Goblin Huts down in the back. So let's go this. Now let's go Valkyrie. Now let's go Fireball. Unfortunately, not going to be able to win. Maybe even lose, which will not be nice. And we are going to lose. That is disappointing. I will get to Arena 5 off camera, guys. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy this uh, episode of Clash Royale Level 1 Let's Play. And see you guys next time. Bye!